Xin mừng các bạn đến với talk show ghế đỏ thì mình đang có mặt tại cuộc họp báo của Hot Artistry và lần này thì chúng ta có một ngôi sao cực kỳ bự đến từ Anh Quốc nhưng mà thì mình tin là fan trên toàn thế giới đều biết cô. Bây giờ chúng ta sẽ đợi vài giây nữa thôi thì nhân vật đấy sẽ xuất hiện trên chiếc ghế còn lại của thì mình. So welcome to the red chair. Thank you. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> so you're familiar with with the red chair? Yes. Kind of familiar. Just doesn't have the. Yeah. So tell us a little bit why you're here. I am here to do a show, um, to perform with my band, and uh, to entertain you guys because I've never actually been here. Like you know, I'm, I'm really looking forward to it, and um, I can't wait to get on stage. Okay. But uh, what you heard of Vietnam before, like. Uh, Yeah, I mean, I've heard great things. The food is amazing. I mean, I don't know. It tastes so good here because back home. What I did guess, you try? I had the noodles and the, it's like a soup thing. Okay. I don't know. It was spicy. Okay. It was very, very nice. Anyway, um, yeah, everyone is so kind. So kind. I don't know. How's the feeling being here really far from home and then perform? Is that? Yeah. Yeah, it's 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 lovely to be um, here, but of course it's it's very far from home. And um, I mean, I'm not. I Is that the weird thing about being a famous singer? You no, can be I, anywhere. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's weird because you never on the right time and you can't sleep and it's like ooh crazy. But um, I'm not complaining. You know, I, this is what I've been wanting to do my whole life and. Um, It's it's scary because you sometimes when you don't know a, a, a place you're like I want to go and see things I want to go and explore and um, I'm having I'm having a very great experience I can't wait to go back and tell my friends. Okay. But you always have your family with you. Is yes. Your sister Elena. Yeah, I always here? have my family okay. here with me. My sister is my manager and she's also kind of like my guidance life, you know and. Uh, Like I said in there, it's very important, you know, for me to have my family around me to, to kind of keep me focused. Okay. Show us your nails. Let's oh yes, say. I got my nails done here, <laughs> and it's good looking. Christmas and uh, Santa Claus and a snowman and a Christmas tree. My friends are going to be very jealous. But it's uh, it's so cool that you, gone to such a strange and far country, but you actually want to to get there and go to a small shop and, yeah. and met this. Yeah, I, I came to the hotel, I said, I want to go get my nails done. Okay. And so I went for a walk okay. and uh, some people were like, Nobody was that? Out. <laughs> yeah, but I just waved and I went upstairs and I got my nails done in a small place. And uh, it was funny because I think that they were all laughing and I, and I was like, hey guys. And they were like, this is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cool. Um, about the performance, how many songs are you going to perform? I am going to do seven songs. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, I wanted to do a show. I think we're doing a, a, a set. I have my dancers and my live band, and um, I just wanted to sing for you guys because I, I, I really don't get to come here a lot, so I wanted to put on a nice, a nice show. I read an article, it's a very nice article by you, saying that the, you rewriting the whole pop star playbook. I hope which so. Is, <laughs> oh, that's nice. <laughs> yes, this. So, so it's, all, it's like 360. It's about you trying to do many, yeah. like you use all the talents you have, right? You, you. you act, you judge, you uh, do fashion. So, uh, so why you decided to do all that and how you get time to do all that? Um, I don't have a social life. <laughs> okay. I don't really see my friends that much. Um, you know, I love to work and when I, I always said to myself, if I get to do what I love, I'm going to do it to the fullest. And that means doing things that I haven't even thought about, like designing. I love fashion, you know, I love to dress up. I've always been a fan of it. so. All these opportunities were coming to me. You know, can you design a collection? Can you be in this movie? Can and I? Why would I say no? You know, if if someone else was being asked to do something, I don't think that they would necessarily say no straight away. And it depends on what type of artist you are. You know, I'm an artist that likes to do a bit of everything. Um, and if I can, why not? You know, if you do it properly, you know, I, I spend a lot of time on my music. I spend a lot of time on my designing. I spend a lot of time on. Um, creating my visuals for my shows and it's all I do it's my life so I, I really do enjoy it and 
if I can set a pathway for artists to do a 360 kind of entertainment, then, then I'm very happy with that. But what you haven't done that, that you really want to do, what you haven't done yet? I haven't... It's hard, right? No, it isn't. If I can set a pathway for artists to do a 360 kind of entertainment, then, then I'm very happy with that. Okay. But what you haven't done that, that you really want to do, what you haven't done yet? I haven't... Um... It's hard, right? No, it isn't. <laughs> I still want to do lots of things. I'd love to, you know, be in another movie and release music again worldwide and be on tour. and. Next year, I'm really focusing on my album and coming on tour and maybe even coming back here. Okay, okay. Cool. Are you a feminist? You know, I, when people ask me that, they get very scared of the word. The word is very intimidating because it's been used in contents that sometimes are a bit scary, you know, but I, I'm definitely a supporter. I'm very proud of being a female. I'm very proud of holding my own and I, I really want to support other females that need support and you know it's not necessarily a bad thing it's just more us sticking together yes and that for me is inspiring but the the reason i asked that because you have such a strong like image as a role model for how are you without being on stage or of course this is how i look at you but you if i see all your pictures, it's, it's very strong, sexy, redless. Thanks. Um, but is it, <laughs> but you think it's the, it's such a, a role model for every girl would look up to, like you shape the, the way you do in Thanks. the... Thanks. Well, but is that the purpose or are you always, yeah. that's how you uh, always... I've, I've always been myself. Um, I kind of, I've never really done something on purpose. Like, you know, some people may think sometimes I dress crazy or, you know, I do things. And um, I've always been very real with who I am as a person. And I think my fans know that. And we have a really strong bond. And it's about trusting, you know. I trust my fans and my fans trust me. And I think that is more important than anything. And I, and I do it so I can give them inspiration and make them feel comfortable and, um, I, I'm not the skinniest person out there, you know? I have curves, I have a bum, and I, and I, and I really want women to feel comfortable in their skin. I, I do it just, maybe just so someone can inspire me one day, you know? I grew up loving Madonna and, uh, and loving women that were proud of who they were, and so, you know, my mum is the best in the world. She's my biggest inspiration, and, you know, yeah. I'm gonna ask a cheesy question Go ahead. about love. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think about love and how you find love? Your celebrities. Oh. <laughs> do you know? Because can you help me? Because I wish I knew. <laughs> Maybe some VME guy. <laughs> um, I I can't answer that question because I'm still a girl and every girl likes to feel loved and you know I, I I do not have the answer. Trust me. If I had the answer to love, I'd be telling everybody. I'm still trying to figure it out. So. When you know, can you let me know? <laughs> I don't think that any woman can help you on yeah. it. But what when strike you right away? In a man. Funny, laugh, okay. someone comfortable, someone that's funny, and um, you know, someone that we can enjoy each other's company and like have a good time. Anyway, good luck. Thank <laughs> I'm you. I'm sure you get it. You get it too. <laughs> but about tonight, can you send some love to our? You can look at the camera over there. Just if you have some. Thing to say? Yes. Thank you so much for having me. And Vietnam, you're awesome. And I'm very, very proud and grateful to be here. And um, hopefully, I'll come back for tour. And if I do, I hope I see you there. Thank you. OK. <laughs> Thank you so much for, uh, for taking time with us. Yeah, I hope I'll see you again. You seem very fun. Thank you. I hope I see you too. <laughs> OK. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>